hello and welcome to my channel the mistake now it's time to i will let you know that how to activate a parents or a child account through mobile application right i already made a video and uploaded on a youtube that how to activate parents or child account through the web browser right so today i'm going to let you know how to activate in a mobile application and what are the things that we have to keep in mind while activating so make sure you are watching the videos starting from beginning to end okay so let's start i'm just going to open a message box where i received a message here right for the activation now see i received here the two url the first one to download the mobile application and the second one if you wanna be activate from the web browser so i already made a video through the web browser i will just drop a link in the description also that how you can do in a web browser right now i am going to do from the mobile application right see how uh, what are the things i received through the message the first one the two urls and the username that will be my mobile number on which i received the message also the otp and the school code right so i'm just going to tap on this one and i'm just going to open with the chrome once i will open it it will directly go to the play store see here i already download the application so i'm just going to open it once i will click on open i have to feed the school code that is uh, uh, if you can if i can show you see here the school code is the rohita nt and the username and my, and the my otp right so i'm just going to feed this one that is a uh, rohita nt going to proceed after that you are able to find your school name the username the mobile number on which you received a uh, message and again the otp right this one otp that i received okay now click on sign in sorry i just did a mistake actually i just uh, type an incorrect number here so i'm just going to change it yeah now see here i have to make a password this is a parents login okay so first i'm just click on it okay now see i'm just uh, making a password that is a combination of a lower and upper case with a special character so i just feed it pass hashtag one two three four you can see this is a strong right so i'm going to proceed once i will proceed after that i received a message that account has been uh, created or activated successfully so i'm just going back again now see once you activate your parents account you will find your child name here suppose you have a sibling so you will find the name of the both the students or both your child and here you have to make a password for the child so you are the responsible for the child account right so like if you want to check the what are do, uh, they are doing doing the live lecture and also you can uh, watch it there right so i'm just going to make a password common for both the parents and uh, students if you want to make the different password you can also do it so i'm just going to make it different i just uh, feed one two three four and five right so i just fix the password here then click on done now see account has been created okay see here i also received a message that child account has been also activated i'm going to click on this so i can just receive the notification whatever the school will uh, like uh, uh, send some notification to us right now see here i have many different things like what is the difference between the student and parents so the parents can pay the fees parents can uh, like uh, find out the permissions fee the school fees the transportation and all, all but they can't attend a live lecture they can't uh, attend an online test here to activate or uh, to find out or uh, like to join the live lecture what you have to do first log out from here so i'm just going to log out from the parents account i just click on log out then i will log in through the child account okay so again i'm just going to feed the school code after that the username of your student okay the username should be your admission number or a student id or whatever the school will provide to you so that is your username it might be many times that is the admission number or a student id so that will be a username and the password that i created right now for my child that is the one two three four see this one 
the username and the fine now you click on sign in after that again click on yes so we'll able to receive the notification okay now see here what is the difference there like uh, in the parents and student and now you can see I have the option of the live lecture at the same screen I can conduct or uh, sorry join uh, online examinations also from the homework tab right once we have a live lecture uh, online examinations is scheduled we are able to watch here so this is the steps that we have to follow make sure once you create your parents account you log out and log in as a student account using their admission ID or a student ID and a password that you created. So thank you.